Ever had any issues with your Bluetooth accessories disconnecting? Well, this is an app that can help you with this. From the same developer who brought us Home Cam, Home Pass, and soon to be released the Home Run, Home Scan is a Bluetooth range finder that has a app for the iPhone, the iPad, and even a Apple Watch app. This is definitely going to help you figure out whether or not the placement of your Bluetooth devices is causing you some issues. And as well, it might give you some indication that maybe you might want to move things around a little bit. Move your Apple TV closer, get another home pod to put that in place to extend your Bluetooth. Let's take a look and see how this works. So take a look at the iPad version first. As you can see, this is basically going to go through and it is going to scan all your different devices. You can filter out for HomeKit only. And um, if we want to, we can actually click on one of these and get a little bit more information. Now, the iPad application is a little bit behind the iPhone right now, so I'm sure the developer is going to be working on that. But as you can see, you're going to be able to graph. You'll get a value of as to what the, the strength is of this particular Bluetooth device. And what's also kind of nice is it's going to pull in, um, if possible, your HomeKit data and let you know which devices are in what rooms to give you a little bit more clarity on what you're dealing with. So there's recently been some updates on the iPhone app, which makes this even cooler, is you've got not just the ability to go in and look at all your devices, split them out based on, you know, is it in the office, where do these things exist? But if you click on the individual device, it will give you the peak, the average, and give you a really clear indication, is my signal strength good, is it fair? So we don't have to kind of wonder, what does minus 61 actually mean? Right, that's pretty cool. And as like I said, as you can look through the list here, you can filter by home kit only. So really to break that down. So if you've got a lot of Bluetooth devices in your area, you can kind of really quickly go in and figure out exactly which one is which. You do have the ability, although I'm not showing it here, to be able to go in and also mark a non home kit device as home kit if for some reason, because naming conventions, these kinds of things, the app isn't able to get that um, identified the first time. And of course, the iPhone app also has that graphing capability if you prefer to look at things in a graph, right? So we've got that as well. So this is pretty cool. One of the really nice touches about this, though, is the Apple Watch app. So this is going to connect back to your, your phone or your iPad. Um, and what it's going to do is it's going to allow you to leave your phone in one place and then use your watch to be able to actually see what the signal strength is as you walk around and as you um, change the placement of your Bluetooth devices, which is pretty cool, right? So you can have your phone perhaps above your Apple TV or your HomePod tracking it from there. And then you can use your watch to track and move the, the actual accessory around to get a much better idea of where you're going to be able to place this accessory to have the best success and the best quality of signal. What do you guys think? Is this a useful application? It's definitely helped me um, solve a couple of problems. Uh, it's definitely was worth a couple of bucks. You know, I would highly recommend picking it up, supporting um, Aaron, the developer. He's been great in in creating, you know, the, the whole home suite of applications for Apple HomeKit. And I'm excited to see where he takes this and what else he comes up with. Questions, comments, put them below. You know where to do that. Subscribe if you haven't already. Likes are always appreciated. And if you want to learn how to make your house just a little bit smarter, please do check out my Udemy course. There is a coupon code in the details below.